Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the Kibana interface and building visualizations from the syslogs coming in from the FortiGate uh, firewall to the Elasticsearch cluster. If you want to see how I built the Elasticsearch cluster and how I'm ingesting, how I ingested my FortiGate syslogs to the to the stack, uh, check out my other videos, and I will link them in the description. This is just an example of how you can use Kibana and what you can use it for. So right here on the home screen, when you log into Kibana, you have those four major areas that you can use Elasticsearch and Kibana uh, for. Enterprise Search, Observability, Security, Analytics, and you can access them here uh, from the side uh, view. Uh, you can also uh, go to the management options here in Kibana and Elasticsearch. And you can start by adding integrations, uh, so you can start ingesting data from different sources. And there is a link here to display a different page on login. So when you log in, it logged in directly to that home page. And you can change that default route if you want, for example, to, uh, to log in directly to some dashboard, some custom dashboard that, uh, that you built. Uh, you can put the link of that dashboard over here and save the settings. But since we are here in the advanced settings, I'm going to search for dark mode. I'll turn it on and reload the page. And this is just better for the eyes. I'm, gonna, I'm going back to the home screen and I'm going to go to analytics, discover, or you can just open the side view under analytics, discover right here. Okay, so right here we have the data stream or the data view or they called it index pattern. So this is the index you're looking at, the data you're looking at. And then you have here a search for. You can start by typing the field name and the value you want to search for. For example, a specific source IP, you want to look at the, the logs from a specific source IP. You can type it in here. And you have the time filter, this is very important. Right now we're looking, we're looking at the last 15 minutes. You can look at, for example, uh, those predefined ones today, so from 12 a.m. till now, or last seven days, last 24 hours. I'm gonna keep it for the last 30 minutes. And also you can do something like refresh every, um, I'm gonna do every 10 seconds, for example, so that it keeps refreshing and uh, the logs will stream every 10 seconds. And here's um, a histogram. On the, in this last 30 minutes, these last 30 minutes, um, it tells you or it shows you how many logs or how many hits in every, uh, for example, in every 30 seconds. I divided them by 30 seconds here. And you can just see an overview of how much data is coming in over time. And this right here, this view right here is the document view. So every log or every hit, you can open it here and you can see a table view or a JSON format of that document. You can copy if you want. And you can look at here a table view of the, of the fields and the values. You can click the three dots here and filter for that value. It will create um, a filter up here. And you can edit that filter, remove it. And if you put a filter or if you create a new one from here, uh, it will just filter traffic and it, you will see only uh, that value that you are uh, filtering on. And right here on the left side, you will have a list of all the fields in that uh, index or in these logs coming in from the FortiGate firewall. And if you click on one field, you will see the top five values by, and you can see the percentage of each of their, these values. Uh, so the top five and these uh, 30 minutes of logs. And you can click visualize from here. It will take you directly to start visualizing. And another cool feature here in the list of the fields on the side, you can click the plus button here and it will be added as a column uh, title. And you can build a table view from all the fields that you want, for example, source IP, destination IP, network application, network bytes, 
and you can start looking at the data. Uh, for example, uh, just a quick view of a source and a, a source and a destination and a network uh, application used, and how many may be sent and received bytes. And you can you can uh, sort these columns, sort the values from low to high, from high to low, whatever. Maybe you want to sort the network bytes, the sent bytes, and you can move them around left and right and then remove them. Or you can click the X right here and it will go back to the uh, normal uh, document view. And I have an idea of visualization. There's this field called Fortinet Firewall OS name or operating system. These are the operating systems running inside uh, my network here at home. So I'm going to click on visualize. It will open this uh, tool. It's called Lens. And by default, it will create this um, bar chart. And we're aggregating data on that operating system name. I'm going to zoom in for a little bit. So in Windows, those last 30 minutes, we have this much records or this much hits uh, from a Windows operating system, from an iOS system, from Chrome OS. And you can click on the under uh, the horizontal X's. You can select the number of values you want to look at. And there's always that other one. And I like to go to advanced and turn this off, group other values as other and it will show you only the five the five values and we're looking uh, vertically at the count of records so how much uh, logs and you can break by i want to break them by for example there's a field called source name which is the device name so the top three this is the number of value i'm breaking by the values uh, i'm breaking these operating systems by the device name so the top three but i don't have three of the same uh, os running the same os so i'm just gonna leave this right here i'm gonna click save i'm gonna give it a title for example top five or top five os's by device and you can add it to a dashboard, but I'm going to create one because I don't have a custom one. So I'm going to save and go to the dashboard. And now I have the first visualization in my dashboard. I can adjust the size here. And I can just save and it will create a new dashboard. I'm going to call it my FortiGate or maybe FortiGate traffic events I'm gonna say something like custom this is just a tag uh, from here I'm gonna create another visualization I have an idea of, of another one on the horizontal axis I'm gonna select the timestamp and on the vertical axis I'm gonna look for a field called session ID, Fortinet Firewall Session ID, and the function I'm going to say the unique count of the session IDs so that I can get a, a count of how many sessions going through the firewall over time. So th in the last 30 minutes, this is how much sessions um, are going through. I will change this to a line. Okay, this is a simple one. I'm gonna click save and return. Gonna adjust this like that. Oh, maybe I'll just keep it like this. And another example, you have many other types of visualizations here. I'm gonna go under the aggregation based, and I like this one called tag cloud. And it will tell you which index you want to look at. So file beat. And from here, I want to add a bucket tags. And it's a term aggregation. We're going to aggregate based on terms. And the one I'm going to choose is network.application. 
This is a field that shows you the network applications. I'm going to do the top 10. So with this tag cloud, we are looking at the size of the field and by the size of it, it tells you how much, uh, how many logs are of that network application type. So I'm just going to say save and return. I'm going to add another one. Aggregation based tag cloud from the file beat index. Uh, so terms aggregation and the term I'm going to choose is event dot action and I'm going to do the top 10 and with this tag cloud uh, visualization I can look at and see that the accepted events are the the biggest ones we have denies we have lots of denies then close how many timeouts so I'm just gonna save and return. This was a quick overview and a small sample of what you can do with Kibana. I built a few visualizations uh, using the syslogs coming in from a FortiGate firewall to the Elasticsearch cluster and I built a dashboard and put those visualizations in the dashboard. There are so many more tools and features in Kibana. Let me know if you want to see more of those and thank you for watching. I will see you in the next one.